Cedar Rapids is looking for public input on a proposal for a major sports complex in the city. Now, a public survey is online right now for people to offer their opinion on what they would like to see. I spoke with two youth organizations that are in support of a new facility in the area. The Cedar Rapids Rough Riders Hockey Club has grown over the last five years. In 2017-18, we only had 72 players in our club. Uh, this last year, we had 246. We also had overall 722 participants from throughout all of the Midwest come in and do one of our programs. Hockey director Dustin Tim said this season marked the first time they fielded an all-girls team. They're projecting they will have the numbers for three next season, but ice time is hard to come by. It's busy here. Right now, our, our varsity, for example, practices from 9 to 10, 15 p.m. Um, and now we're looking at even adding Saturday mornings at 7 a.m. or 8 a.m. Tim supports the idea of the city of Cedar Rapids looking into adding a new sports complex. He hopes it would include a third sheet for all of their on-ice activities and more. Something that caters to all athletes, not just hockey, basketball, baseball, you know, football, soccer, something that includes all ages as well. Mitch Bloomquist, who is a board member with the Junior Cougars baseball organization, also supports the idea of adding a new sports facility to the area. And it would be great to have a place in Cedar Rapids where we could host a big tournament um, and have everybody in town. Bloomquist helps coach a 9U and 12U team and says they often travel outside of the city to play. We play all over the place and a lot of times we go to TBK in Bettendorf. Um, we go to Des Moines, has big parks all around that we play in. Coralville has parks we play in. Very rarely do we see a tournament where all age groups are playing in Cedar Rapids. One of the players' favorite facilities is the TBK Bank Sports Complex in Bettendorf, which features outdoor and indoor sports fields. We could have a lot more tournaments if it was like rainy, if we could play inside. They got really nice fields and benches are short, so you hit a lot of bombs. Their fields are nice. You can slide really far. Um, a lot of good teams play there, so it's always a fun tournament under there. Both organizations believe that growth and retention are important for their future, and they say having more facilities to play at in Cedar Rapids would make a real difference in supporting local area teams. One of the reasons we travel to different places like Des Moines or, or Bettendorf is because we get to get seed new teams and different teams. So I think a facility like that would bring more teams for us to play. Right now, everyone is, is vying for the one resource that we don't have enough of ice. So a third sheet will allow all, all our programming here in the building to grow. And the survey, which is located on the Cedar Rapids City website, is open until June 6th.